hello guys welcome back to my channel i hope you're all good i'm having a little bit of like a solo day at home today i'm gonna do a bit of sip and paint as you can tell by the title i feel like i just wanted to have a nice chill day of doing cute things you know i've got some strawberries and chocolate and i'm gonna dip it in the chocolate and i'm just gonna sit on the balcony paint and live my best life and yeah it just feels good to be having a little solo day i haven't had a solo day in a little while i feel like i need a bit of me time and i thought sip and paint was such a good idea because who doesn't love a sip and paint um i have no idea what i'm gonna paint yet i'm gonna look on youtube for some inspiration got my alcohol got my snacks so the first thing we're gonna do i'm gonna dip the strawberries in the chocolate i hope this turns out well i've never done it before and i was like watching people do it on tiktok and i was like i hope this is as easy as it looks because it looks fun and they look really good uh so yeah let's see how it turns out okay so i've got my strawberries i've got my chocolate and where's my food coloring yeah so i've got these different types of blue food coloring i don't know which one's gonna work the best this one is like a gel one which people were saying that this was good um so yeah we'll see how it goes i want them to be like blue and marbly and cute and then i have these bamboo skewers as well so that I can like, you know, put the skewers through the strawberries and it'll be easier to kind of dip them. So yeah, let's see how it goes. Okay, so I just picked out the 10 biggest, best looking strawberries. The other ones are just so, so small. And then I'm gonna melt the chocolate in like 30 second intervals. I feel like that's not even enough chocolate. I feel like there's barely anything there, but you know what? It's my first attempt. So let's just see where this gets me. I'm not gonna lie though. I'm tempted to just forget the strawberries and just drink this. I'm literally such a sucker for white chocolate. Like, white chocolate is my shit, man. Okay, so I'm going to put one little dot of food colour in. I'm going to go with the gel one. I have a feeling this is going to actually end up green. Let me do, like... Okay. And then... Ooh! And then I'm going to just dip it in. The colour is so pretty. The chocolate definitely isn't deep enough for what I'm trying to do. That's fine. It actually looks really cute. I need to tilt the jug, otherwise this is just gonna... Nah. And I need more food colour in. This is so fun. Look how pretty it is on that side. You see? <laughs> I'll insert some pics of ones that look better than the ones I'm doing so you can get the vibe I was going for. Okay, so for a first attempt, okay, they're not the best, but they're still gonna taste really good. I like how these ones turned out when I used more food colour in. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna put them in the fridge now because I assume they need to like set. <laughs> so I'll put them in the fridge. Okay, so while my strawberries are set in, this is what I'm gonna be drinking today. This is my summer drink. Like if I'm ever having drinks at home and it's summer, this is what I'm drinking. So it's two Proseccos and then one of these little cans or if I don't want it as strong, then I just have two cans and one Prosecco. And then I'll put it in this thing. Okay, so in terms of my sip and paint supplies, I got this canvas that comes on an easel. I got this from the works, and I swear this was literally three pounds, like three pounds for this little thing. Obviously, it's not super big. It's like an A4 piece of paper, but you know, I'm an amateur, that'll do. Then I got this complete acrylic start kit. This was only six pound. And then I can't remember how much this set of brushes were. Um, only a few pounds because the whole thing only cost me like 15 pounds so you know sip and pay at home is actually very cheap okay so i ended up putting them in the freezer because they just weren't setting properly in the fridge i did end up accidentally smudging them and when i took the sticks out and things like that it just got messy i definitely think i'll do better next time so this sunset here is what i'm going to try and paint this is her channel also i literally can't paint at all like this painting is gonna be awful 
but I'm gonna enjoy the process of it and I find painting really relaxing and just sitting out in the sun with my strawberries. These strawberries taste so good. So although they weren't aesthetically pleasing, they taste so nice. Here we are, I've got my paint, I've got the tutorial, I've got my canvas, the dog is lurking around. <laughs> so here's how the painting is going so far. I've just turned off the video because I just kind of realised it was looking nothing like what she was doing and I thought I've got the general idea of what I need to do. So yeah, I just need to add a bit more like highlights to the sea. Um, and then I'll be done. I'm enjoying my drink and the weather. <laughs> okay, so here's my finished painting. I actually like how it turned out. I think some parts of it look really cool. Like, even like the little waves, I'm like, wow. It looks kind of detailed in a way. Um, but yeah, I actually enjoyed my little sip and paint night. But no, I've actually enjoyed my little solo day at home doing my little sip and paint it was just like really chill to do and like yeah i don't know i just enjoyed it i always used to wish that i was like more creative and things like that like when i was in school i was so jealous of the girls that were good at art so it's kind of cute to just spend the day painting and yeah i mean it's not the best painting in the world i'm sure that no one is shook of my artist abilities but uh yeah so guys, thank you so much for watching this little vlog. Hopefully maybe this has inspired you to have a little sip and paint night at home. Honestly, it was so cheap to do. So if you're ever bored and you need something to do at home or you need a cute date night idea, then do a sip and paint. So guys, make sure you subscribe and give this video a big thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it. And I'll see you next time. Bye.